Hi, welcome to this video about how to sign up with Octopus Energy for their Smart Export Guarantee Tariff. So in this video, I'm actually going to be going through my system where we've already with Octopus, we've already got an account and we just need to get on the payback tariff. So my soul has been in a while and I haven't actually got around to this. So I thought it'd be a good time to get this set up and record a video showing you how to do things. So we head on over to Octopus Energy. If you've already got an account, you can click the account button and log in. Um, if you've not got an account, you can click here to get a quote, but we can come back to that later. So this at the moment is assuming you've already got an account with Octopus. So we're just going to be able to go here and log in. You're going to sign in and you're going to go to your account pages. Now, the easiest way I found to find this small export tariff was just to scroll down and find the section which says um, contact us. Now, sometimes it's quick. It's just to go to the menu button at the top, choose contact us. And when you're on the contact us page, one of the most common things is obviously the export tariff. So you can go down here and you can look for smart export guarantee. It was here a second ago. <laughs> so from the contact us page, you can just scroll down to the search type in SEG and that should bring up all the SEG articles and it's here what is the smart export guarantee tariff once you click into that you're going to get a link here to the smart export guarantee page you can see up here you can actually just go to octopus energy forward slash smart forward slash smart hyphen export hyphen guarantee and it will take you straight there but the easiest way I found was just going through that contact us page. Okay, so once you're on here, you can scroll down. It tells you a bit of information about it all. It tells you what the process is. So you sign up for the export guarantee. They take a couple of days to get you an export MPAN number from your DNO. Sometimes you already have one of them, depending on what you've had with us and if we've been able to sort that out with you. Um, the DNO can take a few weeks for that. And it's just setting expectations here. Quite often it's a lot sooner and then it's all set up and you're good to go we have to give the first meter reading and away you go that first meter reading in general will be from your export meter as part of your solar installation um after that they will just run from the smart meter so um let's go with that so i'm just going to go down here and i'm going to say already an octopus customer start your switch bit misleading wording because we're not switching tariffs we're an octopus go during the day and um so we're not switching we're adding a new tariff but i wouldn't worry too much about that here's the mpan number export meter if you've already got one of these um the you're going to be able to fill that in here so if you've had something like this which is a um, connection letter from your network quite often it will include the mpan number on here but it does depend on the system type and size. This is a G98 acceptance letter um, and it's got an MPAN number here, but this is my import MPAN. So we don't have an export MPAN set up yet. So again, on your MCS certificate as well, this is my MCS certificate. You can see my supply is ending 7083 and that's the same that is on my connection agreement. So leave that blank. The next box down is going to be choosing what technology you've got installed we've got solar in storage so we're going to fill that in and there's questions about feeding tariff usually it's no if you've got feeding tariff you're probably not wanting to apply for seg at this time it might come a point when the feeding is less valuable than your exports but at the moment if you're on feeding it's still well worth staying on feeding tariff Next up is your MCS number. So this is the certificate that we would have completed and sent over to you. It normally comes with your invoice. Occasionally, if there's a bit of paperwork to do, it, it comes shortly after your invoice. But you'll have this certificate from ourselves, and this would come right after your installation. There's no wait or delay on this. So if you're receiving your connection agreement, which is this one, and you're wondering where your MCS is, it would have come in your in your emails that came with the invoice and your building control paperwork and all of that. So your MCS certificate number is going to be this one here. So I'm just going to copy that. And I'm going to paste that into here. 
it says great news they found it so they've obviously got access to the mcs database it's already tallied up so next down here has your dno been up has your dno network operator been notified with our systems you will always have been notified so you can always click notified um, and then you're going to be able to upload your letter so you can choose file here and the letter that you want to upload is actually this one um, it's going to come from national grid if you're in the derby area if you're further afield you might have a different provider but generally it's going to be national grid ssc gtc someone like that so for me i'm just going to type in search and find this letter so it's four seven five four so i've got that there and i'm just going to upload that that's good to go so while that's uploading all done i'm just going to hit agree and i'm going to apply for the smart export so that's it that's all i need to to do to apply to get paid for my energy from octopus energy now this is all um assuming that i was with octopus already which i was now i think if you go into your account on your smartphone there's a similar process for this but i find it much easier on the desktop so hopefully this video is cleared all things up if you're not yet with octopus energy i'm going to do a new video which is going to show you how to onboard with that i'm going to talk you through all that process to make it really simple and easy and we can send you that along with this one so you've got the two videos together so hopefully this has sorted anything out any more questions feel free to get in touch with us we're here to help you through all this and talk you through the process phone number for the office is 01332 498 130 uh, we'll be happy to help and make sure you're getting paid for that export.